Hey mate, this is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited to be back in the Gold Coast area of Queensland, Australia, just like the last time in 2017 when I was at Longboards in Surfer's Paradise. Tonight, we are in Koolangatta. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. Yeah. We are all here at Chupa's Smokehouse. I'm hoping to become one of the elite few to dominate Chupa's Triple XL Australian Burger Challenge. Now this thing looks amazing and it's actually bigger than what it uh, originally is. To watch just the base challenge, be sure to watch Katina eats kilos. She went before me. It is without all of these wings, all of the barbecue ribs and this delicious chowder. So the base challenge, I've got one hour to finish everything here. On this burger, the base of it, there is a 600 gram Australian beef hamburger patty. There are three fried eggs, bacon rashers, some Australian cheddar cheese. There's a whole bunch of healthy vegetables, of course, which is why I got my shirt on. There is lettuce, tomatoes, and then there is beetroot. And then there's also fruits too. There's a whole bunch of pineapple slices. However many calories all that is, there's an equal amount of calories of aioli uh, on the top of there, along with a bunch of their homemade barbecue sauce, all on a freshly baked bun. For the challenge, you've got to finish uh, pretty much a basket of their fries. So, or you could also call them chips, but in addition to all this, they're very well known for their chicken wings here, and then their barbecue ribs. So I've got four of their ribs, four of their buffalo wings, and then sweet Texas barbecue wings. Uh, and then they're very well known for their chowder too. Uh, so I've got a whole bowl of that, along with some garlic toast there. But yeah, pretty much gonna try to finish all of this within the one hour time limit. The base challenge if you fail is 55 Australian dollars. Of course, all of this would be a little bit more than that, uh, which it's okay to do this because Katina, after hers, uh, she had two slices of key lime pie. So I think all of this extra stuff is the same calories as that. Uh, if I do win, I'm gonna get my entire meal for free. I will get a sweet Chupa's merch pack, and then I'll get my name and photo up on the wall of fame. Let's get this challenge started. All right, it is time to dominate. I added all this food because I know I can't beat the record. My friend, Big B, or Vince, uh, from, we did that challenge in Geelong. He came up here and did all of this, the base challenge, in like four and a half minutes. So I am gonna enjoy this and also add some food to it. One hour to finish. Big thank you to everybody here with Chufas on the Gold Coast in Coolangatta. Let's shut up and eat. One, two, three, boom. All right. Those are good. And pretty much all of this is homemade sauce. I think other probably than the aioli. We'll do a buffalo wing. Ooh, those are good. They're right, that is a sweet sauce. I am not exactly sure how I'm gonna do this. Uh, I watched somebody go before me and wow, she was messy. I'm gonna try to not be the same, but I think I probably am. I kept hoping he would stop the chef with the aioli and he never did. That is all right. Let's enjoy some of this bacon. How messy am I? Oh, pretty messy. Oh, really? All right, let's eat some of this beef patty. I don't think we're gonna be able to eat it as a burger. With the healthy pineapple. Still under four minutes in, we're kicking butt. The record is already passed. It was like four and a half minutes. We're six minutes and 57 seconds in. We're right on Vince's tail.
All right, once we get the beef down, we'll be all downhill from there. 10 minutes, five seconds in, we've got an hour. All right, last bite of the hamburger beef. And there was a whole bunch of healthy grilled onions on here too, covered with their barbecue sauce, which was delicious. All right, beef is down, we got this. The top bun was like garlic toasted, kind of like what I think this bread's gonna be like. Very good. That almost has me sick looking at it. We're gonna need soda to get that bottom bun down, I know that. I am feeling a bit stupid about uh, adding how much food that I actually did add, but we're gonna get it. We're gonna finish the triple XL burger before moving on to the fries and everything else. I still feel pretty good, so we're all right. No worries. Hakuna Matata. If you ever do go to Brisbane, which you should, beautiful city, definitely take a day or two and come on down to the Gold Coast. It's beautiful all around. Katina and I walked all around this afternoon around Coolangatta and then Kira Beach. Everything was beautiful, but uh, I'm gonna be up on the Sunshine Coast in a couple days. So many awesome places to get to in Queensland, but let's shut up and eat and finish all this food. Now I am done with the burger. Every state and territory tries to say that they're the best in Australia, and I will say that Queensland has a good argument. We are happy that we got here uh, as part of the, the last stop as part of our Australia tour. All right, 24 minutes in, let's do the wings. Uh, buffalo first, then sweet Texas. minutes 45 seconds in now all right we are down to the fries this seafood chowder i'm gonna have some bites of that it is a secret recipe passed down from generations i guess people have driven from toowoomba which is many hours away just to have this chowder so i wanted to have it as part of this challenge we are on the gold coast this is seafood chowder that is chunky and that is good all right, I'm gonna dip some of my uh, my fries or chips in there. I decided to do all this food uh, instead of beer or dessert. Now I'm wishing I had gone with dessert or beer or both. 38 minutes, 52 seconds in. All right, 
down to the last bite of the main challenge, but we're still gonna go for the chowder over here. But ooh, let's get this and remove the big uh, white platter. Yeah. Oh, we'll start by dipping this in the chowder to get the bread and then we'll uh, spoon the rest of the chowder. Uh, all right, last few uh, spoonfuls, let's get. Normally my last uh, few bites are always painful, but even this full, uh, this chowder is so good. I really just need like another 30 seconds. I already won, I just gotta make sure to leave no doubt. I don't wanna ruin the video by getting sick. All right, we are gonna be 50 minutes, we got this, all right. call that domination, but I am the first person to add that much food. The extra eight chicken wings, which were all so good. Uh, both of those sauces and then those barbecue uh, pork ribs, so good. And then the chowder, so good. Oh, I don't think any dessert for me right away. I had an hour. The record I set for the base challenge is like four and a half minutes by Vince. I am probably towards the end of the leaderboard. 49 minutes and 35 seconds. Like I said, that burger was delicious. Uh, a lot of people in the audience tonight ordered regular normal sized cheeseburgers uh, along with chicken wings, ribs, all the other stuff. There's so many awesome, delicious things. And they've got a whole bunch of seafood too uh, since they're right along the coast. But uh, yeah, now we are on our way back home to uh, where we're staying in the Brisbane area. Got a challenge coming up in a few days in Newstead, uh, Central Brisbane, but definitely great to get here. Tonight, it was overall victory number 1,170. Just a few more coming up here in the Queensland area before heading to Bali, Indonesia. But huh, if you like this video, be sure to watch either this one or this one. I know you will love those as well, but either way, win before you begin. I'll catch you in the next one. Thank you guys for watching.